Hello everyone, welcome back to Making a Game. In the last episode, we did level 4, the uh, the actual first level that's not a tutorial level. So that was fantastic. In this episode, we're going to be doing level... Uh, level... Um, what should I call it? Level 5, potentially level 6, depending how fast this goes. So for this level, my idea... was to have this is something I did in the last the last iteration of this game is uh I had two spinning uh well two sorry two uh big circles big like discs that you could control that w that were hazard obstacles but you could control them uh with the space bar and so they were they were kind of like pie shaped and uh, you had to like hold on. Let me do this. Like, imagine if there was a a big circle right here. There was like a a quarter of it cut out, and then you would pull the space bar, put your cube in the thing, and move the space bar with the. It will make sense once we actually get there. So, uh, but that's what we're gonna do. So I'm going to pull that out. And then what we're going to do is we're going to get a cylinder. We're going to bring the vert count maybe down to 20, maybe even like 15. No, I said 15, not 5. Yeah. And then we're just going to... Hold on. I need to make sure that I can actually divide that into a pie shape. No. Uh, 16 is the lucky number. There we go. So now I can divide that into a quarter, into quarters. So uh, we're going to go into the side. We're going to flatten it out, and we're going to size it uh, that way. Uh, maybe size it a little less. Let's, let's just test how to work. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yep. Okay. Uh, let's so take that, fill, just so it's even, take that, fill, okay, there we go, Dr. Fill. We're going to select it all, and we're going to apply the hazard, the hazard texture. And we're going to unwrap it, no, we're going to project from view that. Yep, and then, uh, 45 degree angle, there we go, okay. I'm just going to bring that down. Yeah, so there we go. 90 degree angle. Size it up just a tad. We're going to bring these down so that you can't squeeze around the edges. There we go. Uh, select. It's a little bit too big. So let's see if we can get this done here. So we're going to do that. And what we're going to do is we're going to space bar motion. I'm going to have it rotate. Let's try one. Wait, what? What, uh, what direction does positive go? I forget. I'm going to have to do it the old fashioned way. I forget. Oh, those are invisible. Okay. Probably because I have to flip the normals. That's probably not it. No, am I? What? Uh. Uh. Okay. Yeah, I get what I did wrong here. Um. Okay. Yeah. Delete the. Okay. So we're going to go in here. Delete that face because uh, what I did wrong is I, I joined them, and so the alpha texture and the non-alpha texture are one and. Because on the alpha texture, you have to turn the uh, visibility all the way down. It, it fucks up with the other texture. So I'm going to have to parent them together. Yeah, because if you go, what? 
Oh, because that still has that. Okay, there. What? What am I doing wrong? Why are they invisible? They should not... What? They're there, why are they invisible? What? Let's try flipping the normals and see... No? Okay, what the, what the hell? Why are they invisible? Okay, let's try adding... Okay, a square. So you can see that. Let's apply the hazard texture. And uh, unwrap that. So that's visible. I am so confused as to why this isn't working. <sighs> well, we're approaching that mark. Ugh. Okay, I guess we'll have a part two of this where I actually get this working. And so... Uh, I'll see you in the next, in the second part, where we try to understand why this is going wrong. And we can finish this level. So, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! Welcome back to making a game! Uh, we're exactly where we left off. I haven't even finished recording, so this is still part of the same episode. Uh, that the la that part one was from and I'm trying to figure out why the um, things aren't working so I'm gonna start from the beginning that's working just dandily size that up and then we're going to or basically gonna repeat the same process that we did last time What the hell? Why isn't this filling? Okay, hold on. Maybe it's because I did it wrong. I'm falling apart! Uh, okay. No, I... Okay. Select all that. Fill. Why... What? Why is it not filling? Last time it was filling, perfectly fine. What? Okay. I'll just do it the old-fashioned way, then, since you're being such a stupid... Butthole. Just size that down there. There. I did it the old fashioned way. Did I? Yeah, I did. And then. There. So now it shouldn't be much of a problem. I can still see it fine. So we're going to add a keyboard, spacebar, motion. Let's try one. Okay. So that is working fine. I don't understand where I went wrong here. Okay, so now we're going to plane. This is going to be uh, the new transparency down to zero. New uh, tumbler power symbol. Do that. Generated UV alpha. Power symbol. There we go. So that's working fine. But oh well. So we're going to parent control P. So don't know why it was fucked up last time, but it's working now, so we're going. <laughs> Whatever that was. Maybe I just did something wrong, I don't know. Uh, but we're going to... Uh, this is another test.
testing process we're going to have to do. We're going to have to, because basically how it works is that you get the uh, cube into here. Ah, uh, that's... Okay, so I'm going to have to delete all of this. And because you'll, you'll see why in a second. Okay, what is going on here? Uh, yeah, okay, so the reason why is because these have to be uh, cylindrical so that the player can't cheat and kind of stay on the sides. So do that, put it in the center. See? So now the player can't cheat and go around the sides. They have to stay within the circle. So that's... <coughs> Oh, excuse me. That's the whole purpose behind this. So bring that, bring that in. Uh, let's um. Ah. Yeah. Um. I think how I, cause this was this was this level was in the other level that I had previously done. And so. Yeah. And so I had one of them uneven, and the other one, uh, the other one, I, they didn't turn at the same pace and so you had to wait for the holes to link up now, I'm not sure when that is Let's see if I do get it might have to make it uh, no yeah so I'm gonna have to slow that down just a tad maybe like 1.5. Okay, so let's try this. Let's see. Yeah, that works. And then should link up here, go in, bam. Done. Awesome. Le um, level, what is this? Level 5 is complete. Let's go to level 4. Uh, set scene, level 5. Let's make sure that level 3 brings us to level 4, because I don't think... Yeah, okay. So let's try it from level 1, and then we should be done for the episode. So, level 1, simple, controlling the cube. Level 2, controlling blocks. Level 3, avoiding death obstacles. And level 4 is the beginning of your torment. So let's see, this should be relatively easy. Bam. Okay, so let's go. I don't want them... Okay, good. You can't actually get it on the first try. Second time around. Awesome. That works perfectly. Um, yeah, so that should be it for this episode. Uh, I don't know how long I've been going because uh, this is all one full uh, video. So um, I guess I'll cut it here. And I will see you guys all in the next episode where we hopefully have no interruptions. No problems with Blender, and hopefully can get level 6 and maybe even level 7 done. Uh, so until then, thank you for watching, and I will see you all in the next, the next video. Hmm. Let's do this. Okay.